Hi friends, welcome back to CAD Level. This is Engineer Ibrahim Umar, and in this tutorial, uh, we will discuss uh, about uh, combined feature in SolidWorks. So let's go to a new select part and select OK. Uh, first, we will draw two bodies, and then we'll use uh, combined feature. So let's say I will select front plane, select a sketch, and let's draw a center rectangle. Uh, let's say the dimensions are 150. 150 by let's say 100 uh, so you can see that this uh, rectangle is fully defined i will change background okay so let's exit this sketch i'll go to the features extruded boss and let's say i will extrude it uh, from mid plane and let's say i will extrude it to 50 millimeters from mid plane that is 25 millimeters here and 25 millimeters here i'll select okay and now you can see that uh, this uh, uh, cube is ready. Uh, now I will draw another, uh, let's say, a circle. So I'll go to his sketch and I will select uh, the same plane, let's say front plane and view normal. And let's say I will draw a circle and I will uh, snap this point and I will draw a circle up to here. Okay, uh, this will be fully defined and I will exit this sketch. Let's rotate our model and let's go to your features, extruded boss. I will select this sketch and uh, I will select, let's say from mid plane and uh, okay, from mid plane, 50 millimeters. And here I will use this one, don't merge result. Okay, otherwise it will treat uh, these two bodies as a single body. So I will uncheck this, uh, this one and I will select okay. And now you can see that we have two solid bodies. Okay, uh, this one and this one. Uh, let's uh, okay. Let's make this solid body. Let's say seventy millimeters. Okay. And uh, now you can see that we have two separate solid bodies. One is this one, and one is this one. Now I will apply a separate colors to these bodies so that we can differentiate. So I will select this one, and I'll go to a color. And let's say I will apply this color to this body. And now I will select the second body. I'll go to here colors. And let's say I will apply, let's say this color. Okay. And now you can see that we have two uh, bodies. And uh, uh, let's apply this feature. So let's go to here insert features. And under features, I will search for combine. Okay, in the last tutorial, I have discussed about this uh, feature move copy. So I will select this one combine. And here we have three options add, subtract, or common. Uh, well, uh, if you have gone through uh, some basic probability, so you have uh, the basic understanding of uh, uh, addition or union, or uh, let's say uh, common or uh, intersection or subtraction. Okay. So let's select, uh, let's say uh, I will first uh, use this operation uh, addition. So basically what addition does is uh, uh, it will take uh, bodies and it will combine. Okay. So I will select this one and I will select this one and I will, uh, I will click here show preview. And now you can see that this preview, the uh, intersecting part is added and I will select okay. So you can see that uh, this uh, body is combined and now you, uh, we have only one solid body. Okay. Uh, now I will use this uh, uh, second uh, operation under this uh, uh, combined feature and uh, I will use this one subtract. I will uh, clear these selections. Uh, let's say main body is uh, this one and I will subtract uh, this one, uh, this uh, circular body from this body. So I will uh, select this one body to subtract and show preview. And now you can see that subtracted preview of this operation type. I will select OK. And now you can see that your uh, uh, combined body under this uh, uh, subtraction operation. Uh, lastly, I will use uh, this option common. So I'll go to here common and uh, I will select this one and I will select this one. Show preview. Uh, basically, it will give you the common part or intersection part of the bodies that you have selected. I will select OK. 
here notice one very important thing and that is if these bodies are not intersecting so any of this operation uh, will not work okay uh, i'll show you uh, so let's say i will suppress this one to demonstrate and uh, let's make another body let's say on the same plane but let's say here okay let's say here uh, these bodies are not intersecting i'll go to a features extruded boss and i will use uh, 50 millimeter extrusion both sides or let's say 70 millimeter extrusion and select okay and uh, now you can see that we have still two solid separate bodies and let's say i want to uh, apply this feature i'll go to insert features and combine uh, let's say i want this operation type uh, addition or union i will select this body and i will select this body and now you can see that this error unable to create single uh, body that is some of the input bodies uh, basically these bodies are not intersecting that i uh, said earlier that's why it is uh, uh, showing the error i will cancel this let's delete this one and let's unsuppress okay i will delete this uh, the application of uh, these uh, are uh, many if you are let's say uh, dealing with uh, uh, injection molding or uh, uh, casting parts so uh, you can create uh, complex shapes uh, using this command combine and uh, i hope you like it and if you have any questions uh, related to this tutorial or any other tutorial in my list you can ask in comment section thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more informative and interesting projects. Thank you.